it was always about the, the game, the sports, and getting people playing the sports. He had that personal connection with almost everyone that came into the store. And he would order stuff from Sears and put items in the storefront. That was the beginning of Abby's. We got to learn every single sport from a very young age, and, and that, that comes in handy when you're growing up. You know, if people couldn't quite afford the amount that the hockey stick was, he would uh, certainly offer that you can pay next time, get me next time, you're a couple dollars short, short no big deal. He opened the store in 1948 and finally sold it and retired in the year 2000. So that's 73 years, 72 years. Coached, managed, sponsored, and played. But he loved Vancouver. He loved to drive us around, show us all the sights over and over again, and tell us stories about where he grew up and you know where, where he learned to swim, where he would play baseball, where he would play football. He just loved it. He was a huge fan of Vancouver and everything happening around the city. But we're a community uh, store. We're, we, we like watching the kids grow up from four and you know now ten years later I've got kids that were you know, down here that are above me now, and that's kind of a neat part of this business, is seeing the community grow right before your eyes.